Hello there everyone, welcome to another episode of this Warhammer campaign with the Empire and Karl Franz. He already has a good sword of bloodshed, some skills, I think he has one skill point to go for. <clears throat> yeah, that's nice. The Raiklin Runefang, that's actually the sword that I got, right? No, Victor is a symbol of the letter count of this province, equipment by the Prince of Altdorf, Karl Franz. That's nice. So I get more splash attack power, armor, piercing damage, weapon damage. Wow, that's nice. Right, so what do I want with this guy? Leader of Renown, Ammunition, Speed of Horse, Honest Steel. I think I'm going to go for Honest Steel. I really want it um, to be what? proper. Can he have a skill? He can. Hmm. <coughs> right, technology I have uh, acquired the state troop sergeants, so let's go for more leadership. I like that. That's cool. So let's end the turn. Probably Isle Heart will be conquered. I know. Maybe they won't. Yeah, they are moving in, but they haven't conquered it, right? There was a victory there, that's fine. So it gives me one turn to get over there. There's some greed skins that might cause some trouble to them. Right. Your armies can take to the seas, should you wish it, sire. Have them build boats upon the shore, or set sail from a near. Right, forge a defensive or military alliance with Nordland. Right. Don't have a lot of money, and I'm spending a lot of money, but I'm also going to get a little bit more income with all of this. So... Does not have my consent. What do they have here? I refuse. Right now they have three mortars. Wow. And some out, outriders, which is interesting. These are cavalry units with missile damage. Vanguard deployment, so they can deploy probably beyond that. So I'm gonna move the emperor. I am prince and emperor. And this Gerhardt, look at that, the new stats. On march, I command here. Affirmative. Right, I can get normal stance. I'm pretty sure that Aelhart is going to be get conquered by this guy. He has some pistoliers, weak against armor. He has some mortars. No. Right, we're going to check that to out. But for now, do I have anything that I can muster? Not really. Ready. Yes. Really need to get this Attack. battle going. Kill the rebellion. So that's four mortars. The missile range is 380. Just by comparison, is double from the crossbowman. Um, you are attacking the empire. <laughs> Interesting. So they don't have any other missile units. They have well, they actually have hand grenades, and they have sword infantry and halberdiers. Right. Let's fight the battle on the battle map. I'm going to have to send my cavalry on against those mortars, but I think the best course of action is actually to just approach my units as fast as possible. Um, yep. Yeah, probably my spearmen or something. I'm going to put two of them to draw the mortar fire. Oh boy, they are really well deployed. And my reinforcements are coming from the back. Hmm. Not really what I wanted there. Lots of mortars, there's a missile cav. Yeah, so I gotta bring it down to them as fast as I can. So the cavalry is actually gonna go through this area. Well, that's actually where he has some spearmen. 
It's only where he has some swordsmen. So might might as well use them on this side. And use the heal a little bit for an extra charge bonus. Yeah. Still, my units properly deployed will do the damage that I want. Um, You're gonna go behind the archers. You're gonna go ahead of the archers, drawing their fire. I need this guy a little bit back. And right now, it's all about moving these guys as fast as possible there. I'm getting the reinforcements. Let's move my knights over there. These guys, let's group them up. Move them over here. Right, he's moving the missile cavalry. I gotta remember that he has a missile cavalry. Yeah, my spearmen are not as fast as the handgunners or the missile troops. But at least he's moving. Yeah, since he's moving. And the enemy approach on mounts, Commander. Keep your vulnerable units close at hand. Yep, don't worry. I'm gonna get those units there. I'm gonna get the Reichsguard completely on the other side. Handgunners are kinda in range, so... When they arrive there, they will be in range, actually. Yeah, my missile troops will have some troubles. They can already fire, that's good. Come on, dude. Oh my god, that mortar. Right, at least my missile troops are starting to hit. Yeah, but I really need to get those mortars away. Let's get those mortars. At least we're doing some damage. Yeah, those outriders are broken. That's perfect. Reichsguard charged swordsman. Not as expected, so let's move him away. Let's attack those others. Hey, these actually can attack those mortars. Hi there. Right, the mortars are engaging in melee. That's nice. Let's use my... Actually, let's attack the sword, uh, the swordsman there. Yeah, the outriders over there. That's nice. Keep hitting them. Poor pistoliers. Where are my Reichsguard? Hi there, dudes. Reichsguard, you're gonna charge on those swordsmen. Actually, over here. Look at that morale dropping because of their proximity. Look at that. Swordsman, kill those halberdiers! That was nice. It is war. Attack. We are Sigma's heirs. Lord is under attack, so is his, and we got it. <laughs> the Empire endures. 
Right, so I think everything will be fully destroyed. That was good. The idea worked, you know, the fact that I managed to get those. Oh, there's Hans Ludendorff here. There we go. There we go, let's fast forward a little bit. At least I managed to, you know, uh, fix what is the, um, uh, the rebellion that was going on. And since we fixed the rebellion, there's not a lot of stuff that we need to worry about. Only the counterattacks. But at least, you know, we destroyed one faction. That's always what you have to keep doing, you know. And right now I'm trying to recruit another army, which is also good. There we go, and he's gonna die. Come on. You can see his strength. Let's watch him tumble. My dude, man. My dude. Hold the line! The effect is awesome. <laughs> Let's end the battle. Good. You know, just rush the front um, with them. Um, worked perfectly. I lost 300 men. Most of them were from the, the mortars. But yeah. Can get more treasury. Loot gained. Or I can kill the captives and get more leadership. But I would get a lot of treasury there. Onwards! Praise Sigma. Is it time? Alright, I can attack this guy again and just auto resolve it this time. Getting a little bit of loot. It's good, and this time I'm not going to pardon, I'm going to execute him. Passive ability, the banner of eternal flame. What does it give? Once after effects, the fire is induced. This banner burns with the fire that can never be quenched, and bring its bearers with flaming weapons and fiery eyes. Oh! Bring me to my men. Where can I, can I check that? Battle effects. Right, it's going to take a turn to do so, and then I don't know how I can change that, but alright. Skills, 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 skills. I like the honest steel, man. I need to get my... Yeah, I need to get my men as strong as possible with this army. Who calls? Right now, I can't take the, the turns to over it. there. Uh, if I go on March, no it'll be two on turns. March. So might as well do so. I can't. I could upgrade all hearts, but I can't do so. Man, the taxes. It's due to the army of What does the course. emperor bid? Let us move. So right now I'm going to move over here, and I can recruit some units. It'll be 78 in upkeep. Nah, it's too much. I need money. I need money. I'm gonna get a lot of money from, you know, from the upkeep and such. But for now, really don't want to mess with that. Yep, yeah, really don't want to mess with that for now. Let me check on diplomacy. You want to trade once and for all? I will all. listen, but my time is short. Oh, they're low. Let me see on attitude. It is improving, so one I by one, King at some point they are going to accept it. Come on. I will listen, but my time is short. Nah, they won't take that. 
Where's the Northland? It's deteriorating, so I Delivery really should and need... My presence. Nine aggression pact, I can't do that. Could pay them. Gifts, small gift. Right, no. He doesn't want that. And it's deteriorating, so not good for us. Not good for us. Still have plenty of money, so let's see what happens. I am Prince and Emperor. So far it's not looking good because I don't have replenishment with this Summon army. The counts. I will not he has this army. Hopefully they are at war against these guys, so they will deal with them. Let's see what, what happens next turn. Yeah, I knew they would attack. No point defending here, but let's just see what they have. Plenty of these pistoliers, plenty of swordsmen, and a mortar. That's a good army. Cannot resolve and lose this one. What is their loot? They've raised the settlement. Right. Then I have to go there and take it back. That's bad. The worst part about this a strategic right. overview can be useful in such a right, negative growth because of Krumborg. Mm -hmm. I command here. Okay, if I move there in order to unraise it, how can I unraise it? Ready. Right click to colonize this settlement and it costs 1000. Okay, I could have that. But for now, I'm going for other stuff. So I got here. If I get here, it unlocks technologies and it gives me income. That's good, but it costs a lot of money. Over here, I can get the captain and the handgunners, but they require gunsmith. So all that I can get is the Empire captain. Or I can get something extra like the blacksmith for empire knights and halberdiers. I like that. Costs 4,000. You can get the tap room, which really isn't important. A clay pit gives me income Wing and pottery resource. They're really nice. That's required for trade. Or I can get horse or rakesford for the rakes cart that requires the armory. I can get pistoliers with the stables here. Now, here's what I believe. Over here, I should get the blacksmith. But I should get decent stuff here for more income. So I can get a cloth here. I can get the stables there. Yeah, so if I can get the stables there, you know. In order to get better recruitments there, that's 2,500, I would get 2,000 extra still. That I can use to improve the clothier. And over here I'm not building anything yet. I could get the clay pit. Yeah, but I need to save for the blacksmith. So if I build the blacksmith now, I won't have enough money for the other things. If I build here, I will get money in three turns. I think that's the best course of action. I think that is the best course of action. He's sending a couple of troops here. Bring me to my men. Now he doesn't. Ha he does have another army nearby, but I am prince and emperor. I think my I think my garrison with my yes. friends here can survive that. Uh, I would get okay. one, two, three. And that's it. And that's about as Summon many troops as I counts. need. And if I go here and right click it, I won't have enough money for anything else in the near future. 
Right, so maybe I can get to Helmgard only, so that I can be... Well, honestly, where I am is actually the best spot. I can defend anything. And over here, I can still build that up. Now I can still build... Can I build the stables? I can't. Yeah, I should be going for new construction slots. Over here should be the blacksmith. Yeah, I think that's that's it because it can raise the fourth, of course. Yeah, because then I I won't be able uh, well I won't be able to get to Demigrief Demigrief Knights if I build the staples here. That's a problem. That's a problem actually. So I kind of need the stables here anyways. And then on the other places... Yeah, I should get... Could get the tap room, but I don't really need another one. Because I'm stationing units. I don't need a guardhouse. I really don't need that. And I certainly don't need the training field here. Actually, I could have the training field and dis dismantle this one, but... Yeah, because this goes only to barracks. That's nice, it goes only to barracks, so... Hmm, interesting. Over here should actually go for the gunsmith. You see? Cannot build because I have insufficient money. The steam tank. <laughs> it's amazing. Could get the rakes for it, but that's on the third. Why doesn't it show up here? It actually shows up. So I could get it there. Instead of the stables, you know. Hmm. Right, so for now... Yeah, I really don't need that, that uh, over there. I could go for the Clothier. I am actually going already for the Clothier. So nothing that I can do there. Yeah, I could go for the stables, but that's the only thing that I would get. Well, I get these guys. Yeah, that's what I would get. I need the blacksmith here. Because it can get to level 4. Yep. That's it. But I could actually get the Imperial Harbor as well, but oh well. Uh, let me check the... Chapter objectives. Make a faction join your confederation. That's not easy. Recruit a battle wizard. Sure that you built a foundry. Complete eight of the following miss missions. Complete one quest chains. Alright. That's gonna be difficult. Ready. That's one that's gonna be going to be difficult. Alright. Gotta end up the turn right now, but, well, I actually ended up a little bit more uh, time than I expected here. So, guys, I'm going to see you guys on the next episode. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.